The Doorbell Ring, written by Pat Hutchins. I've made some cookies for tea," said Ma. "Good," said Victoria and Sam. "We're starving." "Share them between yourselves," said Ma. "I made plenty." "That's six each," said Sam and Victoria. "They look as good as Grandma's," said Victoria. "They smell as good as Grandma's," said Sam. "No one makes cookies like Grandma," said Ma. As the doorbell rang, it was Tom and Hannah from next door. "Come in," said Ma. "You can share the cookies." "That's three each," said Sam and Victoria. "They smell as good as your grandma's," said Tom, "and look as good," said Hannah. "No one makes cookies like Grandma," said Ma. As the doorbell rang, it was Peter and his little brother. "Come in," said Ma. "You can share the cookies." "That's two each." Said Victoria and Sam, "They look as good as your grandma's," said Peter, "and smell as good." Nobody makes cookies like Grandma," said Ma, as the doorbell rang. It was Joy and Simon with their four cousins. "Come in," said Ma. "You can share the cookies." That's one each," said Sam and Victoria. "They smell as good as your grandma's," said Joy. "And look as good," said Simon. "No one makes cookies like Grandma," said Ma. As the doorbell rang, and rang. Oh dear," said Ma, as the children stared at the cookies on their plates. "Perhaps you'd better eat them before we open the door." "We'll wait," said Sam. It was Grandma with an enormous tray of cookies. "How nice to have so many friends to share them with," said Grandma. "It's a good thing I made a lot." And no one makes cookies like Grandma," said Ma, as the doorbell rang.